This video is the next step in your coil pot, which is trimming and addressing the lip of the pot. We are on step five for this video. So once you're done smoothing the inside and the outside of your pot and condensing your pot with the paddles, it is time to move on to cut off that wonky lip and get it nice and ready for the next step. To trim the lip of my coil pot, I have a few options. Um, this option, number one, is to take a piece of paper and tear tabs into it at the bottom. You're going to then use the straight edge of the paper. I would cut a thin strip, and you can wrap it all the way around your piece. So you were, it's going to get a little bit wet, and that's okay because you want it to stick nicely. So I'm going to make sure this straight edge of the paper is going to give me a really nice edge to cut along. Once you've finished this step, you're going to take a nice clean clay knife and you're going to sit it along the edge of the paper and you're going to start cutting. Make sure to keep your knife nice and flat. You can pull the pieces off as you go, but this should give you a pretty steady line to go off of to get a really nice and even lip on your coil pot. Another option is just to eyeball it. So if you're pretty confident that you can get a nice and straight and even coil pot lip, you are welcome to try to eyeball it and cut it evenly all the way across. Um, then after you're done cutting, go ahead and smooth all of those sharp edges off with your fingers. And at this point, you can also use a damp sponge to smooth that lip right off. If you also wanted to draw out the line with a needle tool, so if you put your piece in the middle of your wheel here, you can also hold the needle tool really steady to get an even line all the way across. That's a way to do it without the paper, um, but the paper is going to give you kind of the best line to go off of. Once you're all done, if you're ready to remove it from the board temporarily, you can use your pointed modeling tool to kind of smooth that edge off. You can also use a clay knife to kind of give it a nice cut to remove your coil pot from the board.